four black coaches and Tom Brady's a racist for winning. I'm so confused. <laughs> they, they won because of that, but they also won because he's racist. It's getting so difficult to figure out what's going on in this world. Fuck if I know. Makes sense that the white guys are the coaches though, right? Everyone was mad that most of the coaches are white. It's because they weren't good enough to be players. <laughs> right? Hey, Caprio, remember that time we were picking up chicks down in DC? We were at the theater and they shot the president. Oh, I remember that. It was good times, buddy. Yeah, that was a long time ago. Oh, no. Dan Caprio always looks dapper, don't he? Always well dressed. <laughs> looks all GQ and on and shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't start no shit. Woo. There won't be no yeah, shit. <laughs> Y'all ever heard of hypothymesia? H. Sam's. These people can't forget anything. They remember every fucking thing. I can't remember any of the 200 jokes I wrote yesterday. <laughs> Not a one. <laughs> well, I know remember the third grade when Miss Anselmi was absent. We had a substitute teacher. She was missing her top button. We were playing chess in the back. Remember every detail. You imagine if you can remember every one set <laughs> from all the times you had to sit through and suffer what they were talking about? What wrong with me like that? A lot of Dweck sets. A lot of Dweck mentions as well. <laughs> Y'all see Hollywood remaking everything again back at what they do best? Like a Walker, Texas Ranger, that needed a remake. Kung Fu, that needed a remake too. Let's run that one back. They already remade Hitchcock. Fucking. Not an original thought left in the whole lot. Off the record though, I did try to get Zelda and Metroid made. They didn't want to make it, I tried. Shot a movie with El Chapo's girlfriend. If I knew I was gonna be friends with Carl Callan, I would have worked harder to get that connect. You know? <laughs> Get that underground good shit. Why is my shit so far away? Parents are always like, I ain't got time for your bullshit. And grandparents are like, hey, you bring that bullshit over here and give me a hug. <laughs> I got all the time in the world. Broke up a fight in London. Mad latest fella, he was like, It's just a friendly disagreement. I was like, well, Can you say that one more time? <laughs> just the way you say it, he said, It's a friendly disagreement. <laughs> I about lost it. <laughs> they was fighting like, like it was fucking 1842 and shit, doing that one. Never took a tie boat class or nothing. Ruth Bader Ginsburg's one of the greatest inspirations in American history. Yeah. But I saw millions of people saying she was the first and the world's gonna end because we gotta replace her. First of all, she wasn't the first. It's Santa Day O'Connor. Right. Fucking. Fucking people believe anything. Like, I saw it on a hashtag, it told me so. But Ruth Bader Ginsburg, she was fucking, anytime a man was like trying to get in her way, she's like, I'll show you. 
Now we got Kamala Harris. She's like, I'll blow you. <laughs> That'll get me there quicker. Decent human being challenge. Don't touch children. Don't hurt women. Don't fuck with old people. Once we get there, when you're all ready for level two, you hit me up. Right? We can't even get there. It's fucking that simple. Don't fucking touch the little children. They don't know what's going on yet. And the bitches are too beautiful. Don't fuck with them. Some of them are crazy, though, right? You got to deal with it. What's going on up here, man? Like, Greta Thornburg looks. No. Greta Thornburg sounds like teenage missed out fire. How dare you? Oh, dearly me. She looks like Dippy Longstocking. She just turned 18. That shit's on. <laughs> you can make fun of them now. Do you ever notice how people walk on ice madly? They do the little. That's how old people feel all the time. Quit fucking <laughs> messing with old people. They got difficulties. Y'all remember that old timey pose? That old timey pose that the gals would do? They'd be like, they do the, they'd make them look svelte, right? Yeah. Right? And now senior pictures are like, <laughs> yeah. I miss the old timey bitches. <laughs> Everyone's like, orange man bad. And then spit in the face of what gives them the privilege to say such ridiculous things. Try going to China and being like, hey, mellow yellow. <laughs> Try that type of shit. Yeah, yeah, you be, in, you be there with the Muslims fucking getting castrated. What? I accidentally walked into a ladies room the other day. This guy whipped out a pecker bigger than mine. I was more worried about why we were sharing a stall. <laughs> Ladies' rooms got them separated for a reason. Why are we crossing swords, ma'am? <laughs> Some people hate that glass is half full. Other people hate that glass is half empty. And I'm like, I've had it up to here. It's 11 ounces. Why we got to fight and argue about everything, Madly? Mm -hmm. uh, okay. It's 11 ounces, exactly. Fucking, okay. you find a reason to avoid the arguments. It's simple, simple life. What's up, Caprio? <laughs> Y'all hear David Hall got a new pillow company to rival the My Pillow? <laughs> Y'all heard about that? What's he ain't got a name for it yet. But he's got an activist division already. No products, just an activist division. It's not even a pillow, it's a virtual reality pillow. It's not actually there, but he tells you it was. It's all projection. You'll sheep like a baby. I mean, you'll sleep like a baby. You got Took a few gappy years then. Patrick Mahomes was the seventh black quarterback to start in the Super Bowl. He was also the 51st white quarterback to lose. He's both. For the first time in a century, the age, average age of death is lowering. We're dying at a younger age for the first time. I think it's because we conflate wants and needs. Everyone's stressed out and angry. Right? We have filters and makeup and attachments, everything to hide how stressed and tired we are. And that's what happens when you stay woke. Y'all just need some sleep and you won't be so angry and need all that extra. How many yesterdays have you had, Madly? I'm approaching 16,000. How many tomorrows you got? Unknown, right? How many todays you got? 
One. Let's focus, people. I love you all. Thank you, Brighton Bar.